on Tech It Out. We keep bringing you updates from the world of robotics. Watch this story to see how robots are becoming smarter and more sophisticated. Amazon, the world's most important ecosystem. The pristine rainforest and biodiversity are being blighted by mining and logging, and much of it is illegal. As of right now, we have lost 20% of the total land in the Amazon rainforest. We're, we're truly just protecting the thousands, if not millions of heartbeats that exist in this mega biodiverse ecosystem. It seems robots could be of some help here. A pilot project in Peru is using a robot to plant seeds to help reforestation of the Amazon. Note that the Amazon is the world's largest rainforest and Peru has the second largest section of the Amazon after Brazil. Ahead of World Rainforest Day on June 22nd, not-for-profit organization Jungle Keepers says bringing robots on board to join the fight against rainforest destruction could be a game-changer. It has partnered with Zurich-based ABB Robotics to execute this project. Zurich-based ABB Robotics is providing a version of its popular Yumi robot to collaborate with conservationists. First released in 2015, the dual-arm Yumi robot was designed to bring automation to the industry. ABB claims this to be the most remote use of the robot. It is powered by solar panels and connected to solar satellite Wi-Fi for remote updates from an ABB base in Sweden. This robot is incredibly agile and it's able to plant all of our seeds for our nursery. Um, freeing up our rangers to do other tasks involving the reforestation project itself. The robot is able to remove soil and plant seeds all in one box, uh, 16 at a time, and then we take that box and put it into our nursery for it to germinate. So how does the robot help? The robot can plant about 600 saplings in a morning, equating to two soccer field sized areas it could prove to be quite effective in combating deforestation. Interestingly, Jungle Keepers is now exploring the possibility of establishing larger-scale robot planting facilities in Amazonian communities. This would potentially allow thousands of seeds to be planted daily. robots do different types of strenuous tasks and now this robot can come to the rescue of workers faced with physically demanding tasks. How? By carrying the load for them and saving them from potential injury. Scientists from the Italian Institute of Technology are developing a new humanoid robot designed for ergonomic interaction with humans and efficient locomotion. Called ErgoCub, the android stands 4 feet 9 inches and weighs about 56 kilograms. Despite its small size, the developers say they're working to make it strong and robust enough to take on tasks that minimize risk and fatigue in collaborative functions with workers in the industry. At a recent demonstration in London, an ErgoCub robot was teleoperated by a scientist at the IIT lab in Italy. The team envisions workers of the future could slip on a VR headset and gloves to pilot their robot through the more laborious tasks. According to the engineers, the robot's hands are optimized for carrying heavy loads. The humanoid robot is equipped with a camera for depth vision and LIDAR remote sensing technology for navigation. 
So the robot has a certain number of sensors and actuators. First, it has a LiDAR, which allows, to scan, which allows the robot to scan the surrounding environment. Then there is a camera that can actually perceive also people interacting with the robot. Then there is this OLED, which uh, serves for making the expressions of the robot. And this is fundamental for making the robot acceptable in future work environments. We're trying to understand how the emotions of the robot have to be expressed. Makers of the robot hope it could be a perfect work companion of the future and it would be able to do all the heavy and dangerous jobs of manual workers.